is Stephen Jaffe. I play Austin Avery. We Know is a film about a young screenwriter who meets the daughter of his idol and in an attempt to kind of avoid the, uh, the grunt work and usual hours of uh, grabbing coffee and interning and PA work and all that, he uh, kind of writes himself into a story wherein he wins the girl and um, through that the career of his choice. I got involved in the film through one of the producers, uh, Jeff Biederman, who uh, I worked with on a project called Overruled a while ago. Uh, we remained friends since we both have red hair, so I think he has a weird uh, kind of paternal, not weird, lovely, sweet, kind, paternal uh, relationship to, to my career. Uh, and when he read the script, he saw me in it. I met Jake, we got along, uh, and now here I am. Austin is Cole's best friend. He is described as a charming, networky type. I think he is a lot less afraid of um, the hard work involved uh, in climbing the ladder uh, than Cole is. He is willing to put in the long nights, the 15-hour days, the coffee runs, the whole punching. He knows that you have to pay your dues in order to achieve in this industry, and in a way I think he enjoys it. Yeah, I think I'm, I'm similar to Austin in certain ways. I'm definitely a bit of a networker. Austin is a people person, and I guess I'd describe myself as such. Uh, I think at one point in my life, I let myself be uh, walked on in a way that Austin is, but uh, I like to think I've grown past that. I think I was most excited to film the two-hander that me and Dylan, or Cole, have uh, in the soundstage of the uh, television production that uh, Austin is working on. It was a really exciting scene because we shot it all in a, like, a one-shot, um, and it has this remarkable kind of uh, emotional track that pushes through the entire scene. I don't know if it's the one that leapt off the page to me the most when I read it, but certainly when I was there on the day, the energy was palpable and I was really excited by what we got. Probably that's an Arby's down there, man. I was in a kindergarten class and um, some people were like uh, scouting talent for, I believe the movie was a cool dry place. And they came in and I think I just had red hair and was very uh, effuse, like um, effervescent. I ended up auditioning for the movie and I don't remember whether I got it or not, but I got my agent out of that and I'm still with uh, that agent, Mary Swinton. That's, that's kind of how it all began. One takes are always really exciting. That one in particular, I got to see David very much in his element, chatting with a bunch of young actors, uh, telling interesting stories. I think in a sequel, Austin would just be killing it. I think he'd be in LA, he'd probably have a show of his own. He works hard and he's good at what he does and I think uh, time will reward him. based in Toronto, we're called Birds of Velvets. We're a kind of alternative rock band, get some play on Indie 88 and that kind of thing. We did a great festival tour this summer. I think being a musician made me a better actor overall because I started to um, seek less validation for my work as an actor. It was able to become easier and more fun um, and that allowed me to, to I think, go deeper. I grew up next to a highway in Toronto, uh, so I feel most comfortable when I am surrounded by noise. Aurelia is a wonderful place to raise a family. Yeah, it's been great. Yeah.